Alright, what's going on guys, ShakeBake here, and today we have some very, very exciting news regarding Call of Duty World War 2. And this content kind of goes with prestiges, number one, which is pretty damn exciting for me. If you guys like grinding up, that's very exciting. Number two, talk about multiplayer campaigns, zombies, and possibly DLC content already before the game was even shown. It's only was shown in a week, so it's kind of exciting that we're getting DLC content. Normally they don't release it this early, but uh, let's start off with the most exciting. Let's start off with prestigious. So recently, as you guys can see on the screen here, some guy named JBFish123 tweeted to Michael Condry, How excited are you for us to see multiplayer? And it happens enough that Michael Condry replies by saying 55 over 10. And he just didn't choose those numbers randomly. We all know for the past few years, for a lot of years now, you if you get to level 55, you have the ability to prestige in any game. And he didn't just put that there just, you know, to put it there to show how excited he is. And he did t slash 10. Possibly he's saying it's going to be 55 levels again with 10 prestiges and then another master prestige. So, it's guys, prestiges are confirmed in Call of Duty World War II. Make sure you smash that like button if you are excited. Um, so 55 levels, that's normal, that's basic, we expected that, and 10th prestigious as well. So, yeah, that's happy. Let's, uh, let's keep that going. Let's keep the train rolling. Number two, as you guys see also on the screen here, it says, Call of Duty World War II Sledgehammer Games Journey Back to the Franchise's Roots. And it says, Sledgehammer's Games will be hosting a panel at the E3 Coliseum event on June 14th on 2 p.m. Pacific Time. And it says, Call of Duty World War II Franchise Returns to Its Roots. Join Michael Condry, Glenn Schofield, and Greg Resdorf butcher that name but uh for an inside look at the game that is taking the series back to boots on the ground thank god the panel will be sh the panel will share a behind the look scenes development at the e3 content as we look at the multiplayer campaign gameplay and perhaps a hint at things to come in the months ahead now when they say look at the months the things to come ahead it is it, it either it brought dlc to my mind honestly i don't know what else can do unless they're adding in new game modes updates possibly supply jobs which i hope it's not but uh if you guys i don't know really what they mean by that so if you guys have any ideas make sure you leave a comment down below if you guys do enjoy this video make sure you subscribe if you're new to the channel smash that like button if you guys are excited for the new prestigious and possibly dlc content and if you're excited for world war ii it's only a week away i will bring you guys a crap ton of videos on the new content when it finally drops gameplays i won't got to play the game but i'll show you some gameplay i know i'll get copyrighted but uh you guys need to see it but i'll see you guys later Peace out. Everything changes.